The HMF Optimizer is an electronic fuel injection, or EFI, controller. It adjusts fuel delivery to the engine in order to compensate for the installation of an HMF exhaust system. Pre-programmed with optimum settings for an HMF exhaust, the optimizer is small, water-resistant, and easily mounts anywhere. The HMF optimizer plugs directly into the vehicle's wiring harness and should be safely mounted in a relatively dry place, remaining connected during use. It's often a misconception that a fuel-injected engine automatically tunes itself when adding an aftermarket part. However, when adding a component that directly affects the motor, retuning or remapping is required to ensure proper performance. Installing the HMF Optimizer Step 1. Connect the optimizer to a good ground source, like a secured part of the chassis or the negative battery terminal. Failure to do so can result in damage to the optimizer. Step 2. Locate the fuel injector on the throttle body, between the cylinder head and air intake. Check your vehicle service manual for assistance. Step 3. Unplug the OEM connector from the fuel injector. Step 4. Connect the female optimizer connector to the fuel injector. Step 5. Connect the male optimizer connector to the OEM fuel injector wire harness and repeat for all injectors. Step 6. Secure the optimizer in a safe area that stays clear from water and debris with easy access for on-site tuning. Step 7. Run the optimizer wires, keeping them clear of any moving or hot parts like the exhaust system, head pipe, S-bend, oil lines, or hydraulic lines. Step 8. Double-check all connection points to ensure the optimizer is secured. Once completed, your machine is ready to ride and ready to go. Tuning the optimizer. Tuning the optimizer is not typically required since the optimizer has the proper fuel settings for an HMF exhaust pre-programmed. However, if you made additional performance-enhancing modifications, like an air filter or cam, you may need to change your optimizer settings. We will go over each mode setting to assist you in making changes. Please note, there is no reset button. All modes are adjusted manually and immediately saved once changed. Higher fuel settings does not mean more power. Visit hmfracing.com tech for the proper settings for your machine. The optimizer's control panel features a mode button that cycles between each fuel mode. The plus and minus buttons increase or decrease the percentage of fuel in each specific fuel mode. The colored lights flashing designate what mode you are currently setting. Most models will display fuel modes 1 and 8 flashing in the on position with the engine off or during off-throttle deceleration. These flashing lights indicate 12-volt power at the fuel injectors, but they are not commanding fuel. Once the settings are changed, they will be saved to the controller immediately. The fuel settings we're using in this video are just examples. Specific model settings are available at hmfracing.com slash tech. Mode 1, Green Mode, controls fuel delivery at lower throttle positions and lower RPM. In this example, we will set the green mode to 2.5. Mode 2, Amber or Yellow Mode, controls fuel delivery at mid-range throttle positions and mid-range RPM. In this example, we will set it to 4.5. Mode 3, Red Mode, controls fuel delivery in high-range throttle positions and higher RPM. We'll go ahead and make this setting 3.5. Some machines have a fueling mode set to zero. A setting of zero on the optimizer will display a rapidly blinking light on setting number one. Advanced Modes. The next three modes control the timing of the first three modes. Since these modes can often be confusing, we typically do not recommend adjusting these. Also, some optimizers have a total of five modes, and some have six. Ensure you're aware of the adjustments you're making to these modes before changing them. Mode 4. Green-Blue Mode. This mode typically controls the timing of Mode 1, which is the green mode. A lower setting will activate Mode 1 sooner, while higher settings will bring Mode 1 in later. This setting can also function as an accelerator pump on select models. A lower setting will provide a less dramatic fuel increase when you stab the throttle, and a higher setting will provide more fuel. In this generic example, let's set Mode 4 to 4.0. Mode 5, Amber-Blue Mode. 
This mode typically controls the timing of mode 2, which is amber or yellow mode. Lower settings will bring mode 2 in sooner, while higher settings will bring mode 2 in later. In this example, we'll set it to 3.5. Mode 6, red-blue mode. Mode 6 typically controls the timing of mode 3, red mode. Lower settings will bring mode 3 in sooner, while higher settings will bring mode 3 in later. Finally, we'll set this to 1.0. Use the Mode button for cycling through all the available fuel modes on your controller to confirm your settings. Again, tuning the HMF optimizer is typically not required, since it comes programmed with the proper settings for your machine with an HMF exhaust. If you have any questions or concerns, please reach out to us directly at hmfracing.com.